freedom to choose the jobs you want when you want. This video is sponsored by Avail Logistics. With the driver demand at an all time high, now is the time for drivers to come together and fight for fair conditions, more control, better rates and more freedom. This can be done through the Avail app. Avail wants to get rid of agencies so that drivers can get better wages, have control of where they work and choose their own work pattern. Want to know more? Download the Avail app today. Previously on Luke C in a HGV. Go see the Queen. I, I don't think we're going to see the Queen, but we're going to see the Palace more than likely. Right, so he's putting another one on now. I've got to help him direct him it on. So now come around here and hook the hooks on. Dad. North Carriage Drive, which is shut off. This, once we get permission, we go down there, and then we got Buckingham Palace. The roads are all closed on. I do apologise. Uh, again, there's, there's there's no video of me driving in this vlog. I didn't bring my camera equipment, and I didn't know I was doing this London run. If I knew I was doing this London run, I would have made sure I pulled it. I don't want to do it from London, so. Uh, He's literally less than two minutes away. Wow. And we've got to go down there. Off. Oh my god, I'm sweating, that's so hot. There you go, there it is, it's right behind me. That is Buckingham Palace. Uh, so yeah, now we're just trying to get out of this side back. <laughs> and yes, there is dash cam footage in this vlog. Right, we have come off the A419. And we're gonna go get some uh, some portal loose put on. I thought it was gonna rain today. Yesterday was very hot yesterday. It was like 26 degrees in London. But I had a quick look at the weather and apparently it was gonna rain today and I wasn't looking forward to it because it's gonna get wet. But actually, weather so far looks quite nice. Can't moan. Can't moan at all. Right, hopefully there's no one in there being loaded and we can go straight in. We've got a car coming up on the left, but we don't want to go left here. We're good. We want to go left on this one. All clear. All clear. Okay, right, window down so we can concentrate. <laughs> we want to turn right here. Is there anyone being loaded? I don't think so. We are looking good. Although there is a car there. There's a car there in my way. Thank you. Probably didn't expect a lorry to, to want to come down the single track. <laughs> right, where is the guy that's loading us? Where is he? Give him a little two. Anyway, we'll go and say hello. Hopefully we can find him. I'm pretty sure we're gonna be loading from the side of the road again by the looks of it. Might just be three uh three boxes again. Right, see you in a bit. Right, first one's going on now. A bit more. Yeah, it's good. 
Right, we are loaded. We got three of these on. This back one is disabled one with the ramp. So we're gonna jump in the truck now and make our way there. Right, we're loaded. We just got to back out of here now. At the same time, we can get my sat now to take me to where we got to go. Nice little blind side reverse, look. Bow, bow, bow. All right, cheers, mate. Right, see you tomorrow. See you, tomorrow. See you later. Right. Obviously, I'm not wearing a seatbelt, but I was doing a reversing manoeuvre, so you're not required to wear a seatbelt. But I am just going to pull over here, put it on, and also double check our destination. There we go. I mean, what are the rules with regards to touching sat navs? Because I need to plan a route. So if I've got the ignition turned off, I'd like to leave it on, really. Engine running, but not allowed. Right, we are now in London. We're on the A402. And uh, we've only got a couple of miles now to go until we've got to turn right onto Victoria Gate, or into Victoria Gate, rather. And do you know what? This, road, this route coming in today, by far, by far, easier than it was yesterday, going around Hammersmith. So, big shout out to the boss. <laughs> um, but... I'm still obviously coming this way, two miles this way, so I've got to turn right. I'm pretty sure you said I should come in some straight across, but I haven't, so never mind. Um, so we just got to be careful of bikes and other cars trying to go down the left side. This is technically two lanes in front of us, but it's not, not for a truck. Um, there's room for cyclists on the left hand side, so I do just need to keep an eye out for them, but um, cars are going to struggle to get past. Now, I might put this at the beginning of the video as well, right? I'm about to go to Buckingham Palace. Obviously, he's going to be behind the scenes for the Queen's Jubilee. It is going to be... Um, I mean, I'm not, I don't mean anything by it, and I'm not trying to get anyone hurt or upset or injured. But obviously, if I release it, this video, before the Queen's Jubilee, it could give potential... I don't want to say it, but like terrorists, like ideas or... Uh, information that they otherwise probably perhaps would not have known like access points and security guards and all that yeah I'm giving you room love so that is why this video will be released after the Queen's Jubilee not before because it's, it'll probably get asked to be taken down for security reasons I'm hoping that after it after the event has been and, been and done um, you know hopefully there's going to be no issue so Please don't ask me to remove the video. I've deliberately waited until after the event to make this video go live so that I don't get it taken down. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Anyway, you've got to be careful of cyclists because that woman, she, she just pulled out on that road right in front of me pretty much. So you've got to have your wits about you. Just keep an eye on people crossing the road as well. Because they will. They will run out in front of you. We're staying in the right lane because I do eventually need to make a right-hand turn as well. Not only that, but also buses stop on the left, so it's just easier if I just stay in the right lane. That is why I'm in this lane. Perhaps I should have taken up a little bit more of the left lane because it's getting tight up ahead, I can see, and there's a van right down the side of my passenger door. So, he will get squeezed. Yeah, he's, keep, he's coming. It could be a horn blast in a minute. He's turning left. Yeah, the road just narrows ever so slightly and he got squeezed a little bit, but there was no horn blast, so that's good. But right, we're still a mile and a half away. That truck is letting me out, thank you mate. There's uh, people crossing here, but they're not going very quick. Caution. 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 Caution.
Nick Cabin, yeah. Pardon? Nick Cabin? Yes. Yeah. Did I come in? Was... I'll, go to, I'll go out to this bloke. <laughs> he just said, did you come in? Yeah, that's, I'm in, mate. <laughs> of course I come in. I think Ed is doing some security checks. Guy's behind has got his uh, clipboard out, having a look at the load. Uh, what is it you're dropping off? Toilets. And where is, where is it going to? PTO. Uh, it's going down to, um, what's it called? That's the one. Yeah, cheers, mate. Um, you know the yeah, yeah, come in yesterday, yeah. Have you got a pass for me or? No, 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 no. You go down there and if, if, if you do need one, they'll, they'll issue one. All right, mate. I say yesterday I had a pass, but they haven't given me one today. Cheers, mate. Ooh. Just drop me a piece. I want that. Right, so, yeah, we're on a uh, privately closed off road now with uh, no pedestrians and no other ve road vehicles, which is why my seatbelt's off. Uh, I am going to give my contact a call. Yeah, right, mate. Luke from Harry and Sons. Yeah, not bad, mate. I've got uh, three sets of toilets on, mate, and one disabled. One of them is a disabled one. Yeah, that's it, mate. I'm just in the olden area now. Do you want me to wait? Or come in here? Yeah. Yeah, all right, mate. No worries. All right, all right, bye, mate. Right, so he said to give him... Give him five minutes, he's gonna see if the area is clear. So I'm just waiting for a call back on that on that front. But uh yeah, no, so this is uh the holding area for the trucks, which is uh Hyde Park's basically on the right hand side, that's Hyde Park right there. We're just gonna go down here and, and wait behind the trucks. I'm sure security's gonna to wanna to say something to me. Nice day today, isn't it? I was staying here for five minutes, he said. Yeah, will do, mate. Right, so we're just gonna park it here. Engine off. Yeah, so we're on one hour, 18 minutes of driving time, alert, so uh, plenty of time to go straight back home, should we need to. Uh, I'm not actually sure what we're doing from here, to be honest. I would imagine it's back to the yard. Um, right, now we want to put the place we're going to in. There we go. So we're 1.2 miles away from um, Constitution Hill, which is the road we've got to take. Um, so yeah, we're just going to wait here now for a phone call to say come on down, and then we just drive on down there. Now it is a waiting game. Why do I have a horn blasting from behind? Better not be beeping at me, mate. Right, we could be moving forward now, potentially. I'm gonna have to stop here, mind.
But they told me to stop here, that's good. They haven't told me to clear off, basically. What well, hazards? They just told me to come, but. be blocking the path here if I carry on. Oh, he's telling me to block a path. He's telling me to block the path. Go round in front if you want, guys. Grazie, grazie. Merci beaucoup. No, that's French. Wasn't this busy yesterday? I can only imagine is because I've, well, it's 22 now, so I'm, I think they're just accepting deliveries again. Let's see about coming off, because uh, I need to keep an eye on pedestrians. Private party for the green. Yeah, yeah, I know, but I've got to drive till like next week. No, we celebrate the whole lot. It's a big celebration. Yeah, the toilets, yeah, to do shit. <laughs> Everyone shits, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> There's only one shit, you've got a couple of shits here. <laughs> the whole world goes by it. That's it. You know what I'm saying? How can you not know? They expect it to pop up, don't they? Just like that. It yeah. takes planning. Not <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you heard, but he basically just said the toilets are for the queen to take a shit. It's quite funny. Is there, is there more? Is there more? More? Lovely. Yeah, it's, it's a lot busier than it was yesterday. Jesus Christ. Christ, the Queen's party. You want me to stop here? Can you put your hand up. Oh, we're hitting some trees here. We need to move over. Yeah, the bloke. <laughs> there was like a tourist, and she was asking the bloke about. That was the army in there. Asking the bloke about what's going on, and she said. The bloke goes, uh, it's a party for the Queen. <laughs> the Queen's having a private party, he said. Oh, that was funny. And then he said, yeah, the Queen, even the Queen's got to take a shit. <laughs> so yesterday when I come, it was straight road, all the way in, there was no queuing. Straight in, straight out. I don't think it's going to be that easy today. Okay, I think they're allowing posh people in because there's a, there's people dressed up and walking down. Like, yeah. I think it's actually, I think, yeah, there's, there's, there's posh people walking down. I think, um, I think the queen might be seeing people. <laughs> I'm not sure. Where's my invite? More posh people, more posh people. Going for a long walk to go and see the Queen down there. Hello, sir. Hi, how are you doing? Hi, you? Yeah, not too bad. What have you come here for? Uh, to deliver. Here's your pass, sir. I'm just going to wait for my supervisor to radio it in. While the road is getting clear, just bear with me. Yeah, no worries. No problem. Thank you. Yes, yeah, so we've got lots of people here on the right queuing up to get in somewhere. 
We seem to be moving now, but we were just we just spent ages back there trying to get in. There's a massive police presence. I think these people are going into the palace, you know. Can I get past this bloke? If we can get straight in now, it's not going to take too long, but it's the fact that it's taken so long to get to this point in the, in the first place. Get past this truck, fucking if Adam is on the right hand side of us. Crack is, but yeah, anyway, there's Buckingham Palace right behind me. Someone's. <laughs> you recognise me? Someone who's recognised me, look. I don't think I can block this path. I've been told to wait, so just stay put for a sec. Yeah, it's much busier than it was yesterday, man. So much more busier. Oh, from here we found out we're going to Tilbury, um, Tilbury Docks to get loaded with some pave stones, so. Uh, it's not back to the yard, it's telling me to wait. I don't know what that symbol means, mate. What does that symbol mean? There's some st staging going up for lights, I guess. I'm going to turn my engine off. I don't like leaving it running. Hey man. Yeah, there is a track that almost stopped this one. Oh, is it? Yeah, they didn't finish. No worries. <laughs> Lovely. We are being moved forward. There's that chinook over there, look. How's it going, mate? You right? <laughs> Cheers, buddy. Men in suits must be important. They are toilets. Are you stopping me? Yep. Take it, I can go now. Yeah, so obviously for security reasons, I'm not going to release this vlog before the event because it's, you know, there's things around here that if anyone wants to do any harm to anyone, they could uh, get an insight of where to go, what access points to take, etc., etc. So we're not, uh, we're not releasing it yet. We've got to go in between these two trees coming up. I think getting out is going to be just as much of an issue because we've got all these trucks waiting to come in. Right, we're going to 
spin round, face the other way. And here we go, right, straighten her up. We're just gonna go back ever so slightly. And then uh, take these off and get out of here. We've got to get a move on because we've got to get to Tilbury Docks before they shut at four o'clock. Should be able, should be able to make it as long as we get out quite quickly, but let's get these off first. Right, see you in a bit. But I'm not actually able to film much because uh, oh, I've just taken the straps off. We've got one more left to come off. It's just happening so quick. Yeah, that's the last one left to come off. And then we'll head back out that way. There we go, last one coming off. Just want to give a quick shout out to the Essential New Truckers Handbook by Malcolm Green. It is a book absolutely rammed with information regarding anything HGV related. I promise you, you won't regret it. Link is in the description down below if you are interested. The Essential New Truckers Handbook by Malcolm Green. Anyway, enjoy the video. Right, we're tipped. We've been stationary for eight minutes. It looks clear, yeah? Well done. It looks clear. Yeah, it looks clear. You know your way out anyway. That's it. Yeah. Will do. Okay. Cheers, mate. See you tomorrow. I think, I think I'm here tomorrow. Uh, before we go, let's take my hoodie, not my hoodie, my high vis off rather. Seatbelt can go on now. Whew. Yeah, they were just saying that there was a full on rehearsal at one o'clock, which is why we couldn't come in. All the horses were there and all the riders and everything. Full on apparently. Got the police everywhere, look. Can I make it past this car? I think so. So, we've got to basically do a sharp left-hand turn. Concentrate a sec getting out of this gate. Cheers, mate. See you later. There we go, Buckingham Palace. Oh, and all these people apparently having a garden party. Garden party at the Queen's residence. Lucky some, isn't they? I don't think I'll ever be invited to a garden party. around here mind. Uh, I was going to say, like yesterday, I, yesterday I went left, yeah we're going left again. Lovely. And this is the mall I think it is, my wife said. It's like the main street. Let's watch him. Do you want that? Give it to him. Yeah, all right, mate. Let these uh, people go by. I'm pretty sure I turned left out down here, I think. Give him plenty of room. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I turned left down here yesterday. So we will go left here again. Oh, 
Cheers, mate. Thank you. Cheers, have a good day. Okay. No coming back today, yeah? I don't think so. Right, we're gonna turn left here. Can I can I go straight down? Straight down is easier. Yesterday I went left, but today I need to go straight down. Whee, green light for us, let's go. Right, so second delivery for the Queen delivered. Lovely jubbly. We're now heading to Tilbury Docks. Uh, they start taking deliveries, I think, like four o'clock, half past four, something like that. We're gonna be there at half past three, so it should be should be good. Just realised the speed limit down here is 20. Better slow down and do 20. <laughs> I was doing 25 then. My bad, sorry. Um, so yeah, it's all good. It's all good in the hood. Are we going are we going through these arches? I think we are. These lights just turn red as well. This is like the main the main route to Buckingham Palace, isn't it? If you look behind it, well you can't see behind this, but right behind this is, is Buckingham Palace. It's a long drive, isn't it? It looks quite narrow down there, you know. He did say I can come down here. The flag constantly, yeah, he's putting up all the flags there. All these British flags are going up. Presumably every pole. You're welcome. Oh, he's just crashed. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> You've gone smashed it. <laughs> Someone's not paying attention to the road. I think, I think the van driver, I don't know. I think he was looking at the McLaren. <laughs> right, you join me on a Wednesday, I think it is. No, it's Tuesday. Oh God, got more days than I thought left. <laughs> it's a Tuesday and we're back at Buckingham Palace again. Well, technically we're at Hyde Park right now. We're just about to enter. Uh, this is now the fifth time that we've come here, the fifth. And I believe we've got many more times yet to come, so we're going to be here a few more times and I'm, I'm aiming to get as much footage as I can and uh, put it all into one video, that's my aim. Move the comb, thank you really much. Cheers. Hi there. Um, what are you delivering? I'm only joking. <laughs> um, North Carriage Drive? Yeah, North Carriage Drive going down to Constitution Hill. Okay, the way to do that. Lovely, thank you. Yeah, so, um, yeah, we're coming to this place, which is North, North Carriage Drive. This is sort of like the waiting area for the trucks, as I may have mentioned already in the video. I'm not quite sure because I've been here a few times. Thank you. We've got to call our contact, let them know that we're here, and then they give us the green light to come down to Constitution Hill and go in to essentially Buckingham Palace. Yeah, so I don't know if you saw that, but someone just waved, asked me if I'm going in. Go on, mate, cheers for that. There we go. By asking me in advance, they uh, got me in quicker. 
Very quiet today. Last time I was here, it was rammed. Hi there. Hello, hello. Hello. Yeah, that's right. You've been here before, isn't it? Yeah. Quite a few times now. And are you... As you wish you relax. Love coming here. Love it. Really? Are you travelling from far? Uh, Swindon. Oh. So not, not too far, it's about two hours. Two hours? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, it not necessarily it needs to be from Swindon. Oh, it could have been. It can be the company, isn't it, from there? Yeah. But we also get loaded out of Oxford as well, so it's either Swindon a lot or Oxford, either one. Are we allowed to come back out this way? Because it would be so much easier for me. Huh? Yeah. I'll ask him, but it just saves about half an hour of traffic because I've got to go back that way anyway. Yeah. Yeah, and then we're in, then we're in the traffic getting all the way back round. <laughs> it's a nightmare. We just lose so much time. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So I'll, I'll probably be back here tomorrow. Should you want me to keep it for tomorrow? Yeah, no problem. If you are 100% sure you are coming back tomorrow, yeah, then we can change the date. But if not, then we won't take Yeah, all right, no worries. We're we cleaning up and, and then give them out. Yeah, all right, yeah, I'll hand it back in. Thank you. Thank you. Go down there, I'm going to hand them. You know where they're going, yeah? Well, I mean, I don't actually know where I'm going, but there'll be someone down here waiting for me to tell me where I'm going, so... It's all good. Um, I'm just trying to find which which way out of London we'll go. We've got to head north, so... I think, on the way out, if I can't go out this way, then it'll be a case of going to Trafalgar Square. I think it's the second exit and going up that way towards Camden. I think that'll probably be the way I go. We will see. I was supposed to put my high-vis on, never mind. Yeah, you're right, mate. You? Not bad, mate, you? Yeah, good. Um, just take me in there, yeah? Cool, Dick. Uh, we've got all sorts going up now. Oh, being told to stop. So I'll take this opportunity to put my high vis on so I can just jump out in a sec. I don't need a seatbelt on now anyway. Oh. Bow, bow, bow. I say, last time I come here, we turned left at these trees, which is going to be a little bit tight of that wood there. You all right, mate? Okay, we're not going left. Okay, that's fine. Go straight on. I was just prepping for the left turn just in case. We'll be going in between these trees then, by the looks of it which is the same place we came in the first time we come here, and the second time. Oh, we've got a lorry there. It's going to make my turn a little bit more difficult. Is it? You have a truck driver, content speed, and 95 million YouTube person. Yeah, that's me, yeah. I didn't think it was that much. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, basically what you said, I just record what I'm doing during the day, take pictures. So there'll be some stuff on there. Yeah, I know, I photoshopped that, yeah. When was that? When you were doing the small drop? That was it, yeah, at the mile, yeah, wasn't it? I photoshopped it. <laughs> bow, 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 chicka, whack, wow. One more to go. Yeah, that in front, look, that's a WS truck doing uh, high ab. 
with the big, uh, the big buildings there, cabins. I don't know, I quite fancy that myself. You have to do a tight 180 to get out of here. I couldn't go right if I wanted to, like they've cordoned it off so that you can't. Cheers, mate. Great. Oh, yeah, they're putting up some staging look, by the looks of it. Oh, the seating is up. Once we get out of this and we're on the Mau, I'll just have to come to a stop and uh, re put into my sat nav where we're going because we're actually now going to a different place to what I planned to go to, which is fine. Thank you. They're changing this road layout all the time. They got, I think they've got barriers up now to show where the trucks have to go through. You're going this way? Yeah. yeah okay. Cheers, mate. Am I going this way? Yes, I am. <laughs> Right, I'm just going to stop here a second just so I can put into my sat-nav where I'm going. Otherwise I don't know where I'm going. We've got to put in where we're going. <laughs> right, off we go, green light. Ah. Deliver down Pall Mall. Not deliver. Drive down Pall Mall. This scene will be on TV in just a few weeks. A couple of weeks. There's our guys. Some more stuff there. Toy lads. I must admit, it's pretty cool driving through all these flags. Knowing that the Queen is literally going to be coming down here as well. It is quite cool. Right, we are back in London and Hyde Park is on our right hand side. We're uh, just around the corner now from where we plan on parking up for the evening. I have also phoned the guys we're delivering to and um, they, they have confirmed that people have stayed here overnight. So hopefully we can stay. Um, because if not, then we've got, a, well, we've got an hour's drive time left to find somewhere to, to park. <laughs> That's all right, yeah, there was. You said send him down. There was. I'm probably going to stay here tonight and then deliver it in the morning. Right, okay. All right. Yeah, hang on, because I, I have to. They don't even do nothing with it, but they just say, can you make sure you, that you just let, put it all down? Yeah, yeah, there was. Yeah. Anything you need. And that's it, we're going to park here. It's away, away from that side because there's people work running and walking. And on this side it's sand, so it's a bit quieter. Yeah, we just, uh, we just stop here. Plenty of room to get out, should we require it? I've got trainers on me as well, so I, I might actually go for a little walk. Who knows? Right, anyway, that's going to be it for now. I will see you in the morning. Good morning everybody, it is the next day, we are about to deliver load 6, that is some nice Aston Martins right there man, Aston Martin and Park Lane, I'm going to have an Aston Martin one day, I want an Aston Martin, yeah, <laughs> anyway, hope you're all doing well, we're, uh, we're about to go deliver load number 6, and uh, yeah, let's go on in.
get out of the way, tourists. Okay, that's the back of the grandstands that they got set up, look. They're blue. And then, uh, <laughs> YouTube in. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, some of these are coming off here, look. <laughs> so yeah, fifth load coming off now, look. Okay, so I'm now in Oxford picking up my sixth load. Um, we're actually gonna have a quick break. So I'm staying in the cab, he's gonna load me. We're gonna have a break. 30 minutes we need and then uh, I'm gonna jump out and strap up and hopefully I'm gonna make it back to London tonight I'm gonna stay at high I'm gonna stay at Hyde Park tonight that is the aim um, we're probably looking to be getting there for about half past seven this evening but um how often do you get to have free parking um, in London in central London Hyde Park <laughs> so we're gonna go to the to the waiting area and uh, I've been told that we can park up there for the night Hope that's true because if we get there and they say no, we've got not a lot of time to get back out. Um, I'm gonna double check the time. I can work until, I start at half past six, so I can work until half past nine. So I'll have two hours on the old working time, but I will need to do a print out and find out how much driving time I've got left. So I'm gonna do that instead. Right, we are now loaded. As you can see, we're all, uh, all loaded, good to go. Uh, we're gonna crack on. So I'll see you when we get back into Hyde Park. Hopefully we can stay there for the night. Yeah, well, we will. We'll laugh, don't we? Right, so we're, we're just being offloaded now. Just realised these buildings here are uh, production offices for news crews. So uh, this one, for example, is for Sky. This one, I think it said was for ITN. No, BBC News, BBC News, and then yeah, that one was ITN. So that's day three. There's some more over here. Let's have a look at these ones. Yeah, that's BBC International. Both of them are BBC News. There's more down here. There's loads of them. But basically, this is where all the news crews are going to be uh, holding fire. They're uh, they're in a rush to get me offloaded because at ten o'clock it's a change of guard. So I've got 15 minutes to get out of here. Because if I'm not out of here by 10 o'clock, the change of guard happens and I'm stuck here till 12. That's a two hour wait. <laughs> Come on, boys. All right, we're at Beach Ad Swindon. Number seven, load number seven, is going to be three of these bad boys. And they're going to go on now. So, uh, yeah, let's get them on. Right, that's load seven. Just three of these toilet blocks, which is nice. Easy on. Easy on. Right, we are at North Corridor Drive. Uh, just waiting for confirmation to go on down. I think we're taking this forklifter down with us as well. He works from. I think he's been he's been offloading all the plastic pods. Man, I need to clean my windows. <laughs> they look really dirty right now. Yeah, he's been uh, taking off all those plastic pods. Uh, I think I'm taking them down with me. To, uh, to Buckland Palace from here. So we're just waiting for a call and then we'll uh, we'll crack on. Just give uh, 
I mean, it wasn't like filthy dirty. It was only like, because I zoomed in, you saw the dirt, but now I've seen it, I've got to clean it. <laughs> there we go. Lovely. Ta-da! Okay, load number seven. We're just waiting for a forklift to come. Uh, it's an awkward one, this, because it's uh, 25 past four. Should be out of here by five. Um, but we actually need a break on the way out. So we're looking at getting back to the for about eight o'clock tonight. It's gonna to be a late one. Never mind, what can you do? Tomorrow's Friday, so happy days, happy days. Okay, it's now Friday. Queen's Jubilee is Thursday coming, I believe. Or that's when the bank holiday starts at least. Today's Friday and we're on our way to go get load number eight. Let's crack on. Okay, load number eight coming off. We got a ton of toilets here. Uh, they're all coming off at Hyde Park itself. So yeah, Hyde Park is just over there. Uh, once these are coming off, load number eight, we are gonna go and crack on with some other work which will be in a different video. We've got to go get some rebar, but I've got to get some fence posts, not fence posts, metal posts and put them on the trailer. So I'm gonna go do that now. But yeah, load number eight coming off now. Right, let's, uh, let's get this off. Okay, it's load number nine coming off now. Apparently there's 600 toilets coming to Hyde Park just for the Jubilee. Uh, and then when it's finished, 500 got to come out and they're leaving 100 or something for the PC. Anyway, that is gonna be the end of this video. Uh, today, right as of right now, it is, uh, it's Wednesday. So Queen's Jubilee starts tomorrow. Didn't know whether I was actually gonna be delivering anymore or not. So uh, I've left it till last possible minute before ending the video um i'm actually in late and buzzard at the moment loading up with something entirely different <laughs> but uh yeah nonetheless we've done nine loads i think was it nine i think it was nine loads so it was interesting to see how the venue grew uh from when i first went until the last time i went in the last couple of rounds mind you they were just a high park weren't they so uh yeah i didn't didn't uh, get to see Buckingham Palace on the second week that I was there. Only the uh, only the first week, but nonetheless, it was all good. Let's put you there. It's all good. I enjoyed myself. Done my part. Looking forward to seeing it on TV and be like, I delivered that toilet. <laughs> I delivered that portaloo. <laughs> uh, we we got to take it all out yet as well, mind you. So at least I think anyway. So yeah. All good, all fun. Uh, hopefully you all have a fantastic, or have had a fantastic weekend. Jubilee weekend. I thank you all for watching this video. It does mean a lot. And uh, yeah, so until next time, I bid you farewell. Drive safe, stay safe, and I will see you soon. Bye bye.